Hello and welcome to Beat Boop Electronics Workshop. Today I'd like to show you our latest release. It's a 2HP VCA module, uh, which I've got up here in the right hand side of my, mod of my case. Um, so what I'm going to show you first of all is a very simple patch. Just a uh, um, voice from a mutable uh, braids clone going into the VCA. And then I'm using a sequencer to trigger our envelope follower module. Which is being sent to the CV input of the first VCA. And then that's opening and letting the sound through and to our mixer. Uh, the nice, one of the nice features of this module, uh, just turn it off there, is that behind the uh, symbol, uh, we've got an LED that uh, monitors the uh, level of the output. So rather than just monitoring the CV, I thought it'd be useful to actually be able to see what's coming through, not just what the CV uh, input level is. Um, so the, this module is really handy, you know, in basic kind of uh, synth pa voice patches. Um, but other things you can do with it, um, you can do duophonic patching. So, for example, if we took now another oscillator, uh, I'm just going to use this uh, filter, get it self-resonating, and we'll put it into the top input. And um, I've normalised the audio from first to second, and also the CV from the first to second. So if I now listen to this second output, or we mix it into... first so there we've got a classic kind of duophonic patch cool um, other things I like to do with the module uh, is to use a inverter on the CV and uh, then we can get some good kind of panning patches going. So if I take a LFO, feed that into a malt, and then feed the identical output into our first VCA, and then we take the output of the malt into cuts and folds here and use its inverted version to open the second VCA we get this really nice effect where we can uh, basically have the two kind of sounds um, overlapping you know uh, each each opposite side of the LFO is opening the VCA uh, opposite v VCA um, so you know a really handy uh, little module in 2HP 2HP um, skiff friendly only 35 mil deep and uh, it has a linear response um, there is going to be an expander in the future to be able to kind of uh, shape your uh, response curve to be exponential as well um, that'll be coming out in the future um, but at the moment as it stands just a very tidy small little utility module for your system um, this is going to be available on our website shortly um, finalized price will most likely be 89 pounds and um, yeah uh, they'll be also available from elevator sound uh, if you have any questions about the module, uh, just leave them in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer them. Um, but yeah, I just want to say thanks for watching the video and supporting uh, what we do. Um, we couldn't do it without you. Cheers now. Bye.